Welcome to the Week 3 College Football Saturday Slate Breakdown. I'm joined, as always, by Will Schwartz and Cody Maustrom. Next game we're going to talk about is the LSU Tigers traveling to face Mississippi State. Played last season, LSU got the home win. This time it's at Mississippi State. Last time we talked LSU, we all picked them to beat Florida State, and that did not happen. Um, disappointing outcome in that one for us. But, Schwartz, I'll start with you. Do you think LSU can bounce back with the win in this spot? Yeah, they should win, but this is not one of my favorite uh, bets of the week. I Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of at a loss here. I don't have a great read on what either team has done. The defense has been bad, but I'm a little afraid of positive regression in terms of playing the total, and I don't love the spreads that I'm seeing. So this one's a no-touch for me, but I do think LSU will come back and get the win. Yeah, it is sitting currently. Cody, do you have the current spread up? I believe it's nine. It's been bouncing around. Yeah, bouncing half. between That's nine and nine. It touched yeah, ten last around. night, but uh, bounced right back down. Total at 54. Yeah. Yeah, so the total is currently 54, just under that key number of 55. Cody, any lean on the If I had to do a lean, it would definitely be the over because of exactly what you just said, um, grabbing that football number right under the key number of 55. But to me, I, I got nothing for this. I want to see – it will actually nailed perfectly on the head. Um, positive regression, I think, is coming for at least LSU's defense. And um, if both teams kind of can't get it going – uh, consistently than the over. It might be toast, but both, t- both defenses struggling. Um, we mentioned the, before we started retaping, after we had a little noise issue, um, we were talking about their finishing drives. It's just there, there's so many variables, and to me, I'm, I'm siding with Will. I think we're going to see a bounce back, a regression, at least on LSU's end. I, I'm, I'm not going to touch this game. Yeah, so LSU, I wrote down, is top 30 in finishing drives on offense. Mississippi State is 125th on defense. Um, I really didn't love what I saw from the Mississippi State offense last week. They built a lead against Arizona and then just got very, very conservative. This is not your Mike Leach Mississippi State offense. Um, In fact, it's quite the opposite. They're very run-heavy, defensive-oriented team. And their conservatism led to them being 3 for 11 on third-down conversions against Arizona. A little bit worried they get this more third and longs here and have to deal with the pass rush from Harold Perkins and all those amazing LSU front seven guys. And I just don't know if they can test the LSU secondary, which is their biggest weakness right now. They're just uh, 117th in explosiveness, and that came against Southeast Louisiana and Arizona. I, they just really haven't hit big plays this season. And LSU's coverage is, is vulnerable, but they're going to lean on their running back, Joclavius Marks, who had 24 carries for 123 yards and a touchdown last week. I think you're going to see a lot of Logan Diggs in this game. He debuted for LSU last week, didn't play against Florida State, but I think he's very clearly their lead back moving forward. 115 yards last week, transferred from Notre Dame. But, yeah, I kind of lean the under, honestly, uh, despite that finishing drives metric. Probably just a stay away for me overall, though. Uh, Cody, any other thoughts from you? No, honestly, no. Uh, we covered kind of everything that at least I'm looking at. This is going to be a, a wait and see, maybe a live opportunity. Who knows if a fluke score happens right away. But, yeah, uh, like I said, I, I want to see a bounce back from LSU because we were super high on them going into this year. But it's just I, I, I can't really back them just in any perspective right now. Yeah, I'd love to see a bounce back from LSU. Um, I, I, I'm not prepared to. Laid nine points of them on, on the road, though, against what I perceive to be a pretty good Mississippi State defense, especially in the front seven. And LSU wants to be a very run-heavy team, so don't love that matchup. Schwartz, any lean on the spread from you or ready to get to the next game? Yeah, I'm not touching that one. I mean, a lean? I guess I'd lean LSU, but there's no way I'm actually going to be putting money into them winning by two scores on the road uh, at this point. Yeah. That'll do it for the Saturday Slate video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you managed to watch through this entire thing, we thank you. And please like and subscribe if you enjoy our content. Uh, And yeah, we will have a lot more college football and NFL content coming out very soon. So thank you guys.